Hey, this is Andrew Brown from Exam Pro, and we are looking at deployments in Kubernetes. So a deployment provides declarative updates for pods and replica sets. So a deployment controller changes the actual state to the desired state of, at a controlled rate, and the default deployment controller can be swapped out for other deployment tools like Argo CD, Flux, and Jenkins X. So what I'm saying there is that uh, deployment is built in to Kubernetes. So you don't have to install a third-party tool, but generally you want to because the uh, the tool there is very limited. It doesn't do Git ops. And so that's why you'll want things like Argo Flux and Jenkins X, which we will talk about more when we get to our deployment section of this course. Uh, notice at the top here, I say pods and replica sets, but in reality, a deployment is always deploying a replica set. And so even if you're just deploying one pod, it's gonna be a replica set of one. So here is the actual um, manifest file of doing a deployment. You're gonna be seeing a lot of these manifest files through the course. It's gonna be kind and then the type, right? So deployment. And then generally, I think usually, yeah, then, no, I guess spec is, is just for um, deployments, but, uh, and pods and things like that. And so here spec is our pod spec file, which we'll talk about later. Here it says replicas, so it's going to create a replica set with three pods in it. Uh, and then down below here, you can see uh, the container that we are going to be deploying um, uh, for these three pods. So we'll end up with three containers. So here is a graphical example uh, or architectural diagram of the deployment uh, controller. And so um, this one in particular is using Flux. Okay, and so the idea here is you have deployment, it goes to the deployment controller, the default one, or whichever one you install, deploys your replica set, uh, and that's how you get your pods. So a deployment uh, defines the desired state of replica sets and pods. A deployment will create and manage a replica set. A replica set will manage replicas of pods. So there you go.